The protest did not even begin before police started making arrests. Around 500 people came out to the 17th annual anti-police brutality march in downtown Montreal. People who say police brutality happens all too often in the city and the police are not held accountable for their actions. Before the, the march even begin, they just ran into the crowd for no apparent reason. And then since there was chaos, they took that reason to just charge into us with their batons and shield. Ironically, this protest is supposed to be against police brutality. However, each year, hundreds of people are arrested and claim they were assaulted by the police. Police use horses, pepper spray, and kettling to disperse the crowd. Because of municipal laws requiring itineraries for such events, the march was deemed illegal from the start. Protesters say they did nothing wrong. They just bruise all every, every time for nothing. We're just walking the street and they start and pushing us and everything else. Early reports said scores of people were arrested, but many argue the worst violence at marches in Montreal are committed by police and not the demonstrators. Even a university television camera director was arrested for asking a question. <laughs> just because he was asking something. Police say two officers were taken to the hospital, one with two broken teeth. The protests against police brutality are making life harder for the Canadian police, which is under fire for abuses and excessive use of force against people. Ashante Hathaway, Press TV, Montreal.